Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Road to the Philippines. They're getting the uh, pig, I guess they're uh, getting ready to fix some lechon. Just because I fell over at Eden's Park, tripped over my my own feet, you know, doesn't mean that you know I'm not safe over here watching them, you know, slaughter a hog. Baby, I remember this. Uh, she used to hang out and uh, used to sleep in this little. Uh, I'm not sure what you call this. Uh, yeah, I don't. Uh, she uh, used to have a little hammock in there, and she'd uh, sleep in there. <laughs> Funny thing about um, first time I came out here, the taxi driver. You know, I was in there visiting uh, her family inside the house here. And uh, I decided I was going to come outside and, you know, walk around, take a look, you know, walk around, take a look. Um, look at the property and whatnot. <laughs> and uh, I came back here. <laughs> and I just walked up here and I was just kind of taking... Uh, I was peeking through the the slats here, and I was like, I was like, damn, there's somebody in there sleeping on the hammock. <laughs> and uh, lo, lo and behold, it was the taxi driver. <laughs> the uh, taxi driver was in there sleeping. <laughs> and then when he saw me, and when he saw that I was, you know, noticed that he was in there, he jumped up really quick. I was like, no, I was like, no, man, you're cool. I was like, you don't have to get up for me, man. You want to take a nap or whatever, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, I thought that was kind of funny. <clears throat> well, here's the the roosters. This is another unique um, part about the Philippines, the roosters. Can you see the, they're, they got these little leashes on their feet, on their legs. Yeah, check that out, guys. Huh. Yeah, and you'll see um, there. Yeah, they got like a little leash here. They attach it to the ground there, and uh, yeah, they just keep them. You know, it's, I guess that's how they keep them. Out. Maybe that's how they keep them. I'm just guessing, guys. I don't think this is what keeps the roosters from fighting one another, right? You've heard of you've heard of uh, cockfights, right? Well, you don't want a bunch of roosters running around because you're going to end up with a bunch of dead roosters, right? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, they keep them on these little these little leashes. <laughs> Now this one is not, this one's not a rooster. This is just a regular hen, I guess. Yeah, that's just a regular hen there. And uh, over there, there's a couple more roosters. One there, there's one there, and as you can see, they both got, um, <clears throat> both got their little leashes around their, their legs there. Again, that keeps them, you know, from attacking one another. And there's another one. There's several of them out here. There's another one right there. Yeah. 
<clears throat> yeah, the last time I was out here, uh, that fence wasn't up last time. Um, <clears throat> I think uh, Joan, Joan's the one that had this fence fence built for him. And I, I think it was, it was around, I think she said it cost around 4,000 US dollars to build the fence. Yeah. Yeah, a good $4,000. But, uh, yeah, this is similar to like the, similar to the, uh, metal bars that were on our, that's on our, uh, our fence. But yeah, this is, um, Irene's mom's place. And this is where, uh, Irene used to live. This is where I first met her mother. Back in October and November 2019. <clears throat> I kind of like to get one of these little, little huts or whatever. I'm not sure. I don't remember what they call these. See, they use them like a scraper. They get the, pour the hot water on there and then they use these sharp looking, uh, razor looking type tool. I can't really, I can't really get a good look at it. Okay. Maybe I don't know what kind of tool that is, guys. It didn't look like a razor now. Like. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure what that is. Apparently, the hot water softens the, the fur and the hide so they can just simply like, just, the hair just kind of scrapes off. Um, yeah, it almost looks, looks like a spoon, actually. Some kind of spoon. So that water gets super hot and it just kind of scalds the, the skin. Mm. Yeah, that's a heck of a process, but huh. Yeah, Irene, she asked me, you know, she's like, you want to see how they do the whole process of uh, making the chong. It's really popular. And this is one of Irene's pigs that she was, um, that she's been raising and feeding. Hey, I see you over there. Mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, this was one of Irene's pigs. Um, you know, every time I'd uh, text her whenever she'd wake up in the morning, this is one of her little chores, you know, that she would do each morning. She's like, I gotta go feed my piggies. <clears throat> and what she does, she'll buy them and they're little piglets for, I'm not sure how much she paid for them. But then she'll, um, Well, anyway, you know, she would be like, hey, I gotta go, uh, sure, you know, shortly after I'd be talking with her in the morning, she'd be like, hey, I gotta go feed my, uh, piggies. And, uh, this, yeah, this is, this is what she was doing. Come over here to her mama's house. And, uh, that's her, that was her pen over there. I think she had, like, Three or four of them. Okay. And, uh, how long will Jeff stay here in the Philippines? A year. <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't know why he's staying for a year. I know he's, he, you know, he started building a house uh, a few days ago. But as far as, you know, why he's staying for a year, 
Well, I know that. <clears throat> I know that in order to keep his nursing license active, you know, you know uh, when, whenever we graduate from nursing school, we take a we take a exam to get our license to practice as nurses. And I think if you don't work so many hours within a year, then your I think your license goes inactive. <clears throat> so he probably probably a year is probably the maximum. You know, a year is the maximum he could take off and still maintain his nursing license. Because he's probably gonna go back in a year, get a contract, you know, because he works through a contract, you know, a nursing agency. How old is he? Uh, I think he's around 60, I think. Um, I'd have to ask him, I'm not for sure. I know he's told me and I forgot. Huh? Oh, his girlfriend? Uh, she might be around 28 maybe. Or maybe, or maybe 30. 30, around 30, huh? Yeah, I'm not sure how old she is. Again, I'm sure he told me, but I've, you know, my brain doesn't retain information very well sometimes. Because <laughs> I'm getting old, baby. me <laughs> too. I'm getting old, baby. I remember coming out here um, and hanging out here. This is where I first met Angel and Jillian and uh, Julie. <laughs> this is uh, Anna Lynn. This is um, Irene's uh, older sister. She calls her Manang. Out of respect, because she's the elder sister. Hi. Hello. Hi, vlog. Welcome to my guys. Hi, vlog. Welcome to my guys. You want to tell everybody your name? My name? Huh? My name is Jeffrey Tisi de Matan. Shout out on Labor del Sur. I hope you guys got all that because uh, I'm glad I got that on video. <laughs> I'll, I'll never remember that. <laughs> Oi, Jeff. You want to go inside? Hmm? You want to go inside? We go inside? Sit there. Ah! Hmm. They do. Okay. Yeah, this is a. Uh, yeah, this is um, where I was at before. I remember. I'm not sure if that's the same couch or not, but these are the same pictures you'll see on my. Uh, I don't know. I may have, may have posted these on my Instagram. Uh, I'm not sure who that is. Oh, yeah, mama. I, Mama, Danny is back. Who are these uh, folks? Joanne. I know it's Joanne. Joanne also. Huh? On all when of them? She was, when she was five, that, I think five, four. Oh, yeah? Five? Yeah, five. five and that's your mom and dad there? Yeah. Right here in the middle? Oh, wait, yeah. Huh? Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, that's my mom. That's my mom, mom. That's uh, her mom and dad. Is That's it, my mom, Lauren. Is that like on their wedding day? Uh huh. It's my, my mom. That's your mom there. Mm -hmm. And my my papa. Girl. My papa and my mom and John's uh, three guns. Uh, she's been married in college. And the two. Is that? Jillian and Jill Angel. Yeah, Jillian and Angel, Angel there on Jillian the top Angel there. And I 
Yeah. And that's your dad up there? Uh-huh. At the top? Uh-huh. That's, that's Irene's papa. Ah, Irene's papa. Hey, what's this? I don't know, baby. What is that? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. What I, is it? I, I asked her what, you know, what that's this is. Old, that's, a, that's a very old picture. Yeah, I don't know what this is. This is, uh... I don't know, I don't know. You didn't know, you didn't know. This is, uh, another picture. This oh, you want to see? Daddy, Sabi, you're going to see that job? Is it a job? Today is, uh, what is it? Okay, Saturday. May 24th. Yeah, it's a May 24th. I took off on the 17th. Arrived in the Philippines on the 19th. And then, yeah. Wow, time is starting to... Mm. Time is starting to fly by, baby. I said time is starting to fly by. Tomorrow, we're on the 25th, they're going to go up to CDO. Okay. And, and then Jeff uh, got us a room for us. He reserved a hotel room for us for the 26th, 27th, and 28th. Three days, three nights. Yeah, three nights, okay. and then and after that, their wedding is on the 28th. Don't. I need to figure out how, how we're going to get from... CDO? Yeah, well, from... Uh, Philippines. Yeah, from Philippines. Yeah, 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 you know, because we rent a car, I mean, don't we have to return the car to where we rented it? So there's we, so we would, with, I mean, that's fine. There's a rent a car with a uh, driver. Oh, with the driver? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we might have to do that. That way we don't have to come all the way back down. Mm -hmm. We can drive us up there and, oh. and we can stop and see stuff along the way. Yeah, if we can get a driver, I think that'll work a lot better for us. Yeah, guys, we're just trying to figure out how to get <laughs> how to get from point A to point B to point C to point D to point E and F and G, you know. I'd love to rent a car, but then I, I feel like we'd be kind of limited, you know, because, you know, if you rent a car in Davao and drive all the way north, then, of course, you're going to have to drive it back down, right? I mean, I, you know, it's not like, um, you know, cars that you rent in the U.S. It's not like Hertz, where you rent a vehicle, then you can drop it off in another city. You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see what's going to happen. All right, guys. They're still uh, preparing that pig, so I don't know how long it's gonna take. This video has been going for about 35. Going on pretty close to 36 minutes. And I think I'm gonna wrap this one up. If you guys could, uh, I, I, like I said before guys, I really appreciate you guys tuning in and watching my channel. Um, <clears throat> I hope that I hope that my videos are interesting, you know, I, I mean, I know that I don't edit my videos, I just hit play and go, you know, and some of you probably don't like that, some of you do, you know, I realize I can't make everybody happy, so, I just have to do what I do, I have to be me, I have to do me, you know, and uh, if you like it, you like it, if you don't, you don't, and, uh, but if you like it, Hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, share, hit the bell icon, all that good stuff. And uh, I want to thank you guys for continuing to join me on my journey on the road to the Philippines. Have a blessed and wonderful day, guys. Peace out.